Hey guys, it's me, Tuck. I started a little bit late on the recording, so my audio might be off a bit, a little bit early. So I apologize for that. I might edit that to where it fixes those, so I'm not sure. But anyways, we are back with more Donkey Kong Barrel Blast. I realized that I did not get this recorded, as I sound a little weird in my speaking there. It sounded weird. I can't really explain how it was, but it's, it's, on, it's on my mind, but I can't really think of the word for it. But anyways... I've had a lot to drink today, no, not like beer and wine and all that stuff. I'm talking about Coca-Cola. I'm too young for that stuff. And even if I was old enough, I probably wouldn't even drink it anyways. So yeah. Anyways, <clears throat> I have recently done a test with my headset, and I have found out that if I lean towards my laptop when I'm recording, it makes this buzzy noise. You probably heard it before. Trust me, I've heard it. I think it's very annoying, so I tried to find out the resolution I did, and now I put my laptop very far away, and yeah, so anyways, we're going to continue on with level 4 of Candy's Challenges, and these are pretty tough, I'm not going to lie, even though I haven't gone through them, I think I remember trying them, <clears throat> and they are tough, I actually still have more Coca-Cola to drink, sorry if you heard that us in the drink like a blizzard. So I was supposed to be out because of snow and it's gone, even though we left early because it was rainy. That's even worse than leaving if it actually snows, but still. It went around where I live, and it went everywhere else except where I live, so I'm not going to be out, so I can't really get that many new videos out. I'll try the best that I can. I'm getting this one done at like 12.50. I told you all on Twitter that I was going to do this at like midnight, after midnight. I always record at like the very not time shift. Very not time, you know, it's kind of weird, but anyways. I don't know why. Probably because school kills me, and if I just chill at home whenever I get home from school, I'll probably just sleep, which is what I usually do, actually. I haven't even wild moved yet, and I'm already in first. What is this? Oh, I'm doing challenges. I thought for a second I was actually racing. I got very confused here. I don't even know the objective. I could care less right about now. It's probably something like stay in first. I think it is, because I tried it the last video and we did miserable on it, so. Oh yes, mini necky. Eat that, Calypso. Hope your afro pops off. Okay, anyways, we're safe, so let's keep on trucking. Try to keep a distance away from everyone else. Well, I think of other stuff I'm going to mention in this video that I'm trying to remember. Oh god. Okay, good. Let's see. Um... Oh yeah, if you are still... If you noticed recently my friend code video, whoever watches this, um, I did mention that in the video, and I put a comment on there too, that uh, my brawl disc is not working. For any of those still trying to add me, there still are people trying to add me. Even though there's a comment that's before all the others, and before you can even post one, it says that, um, Brawl's not working, please don't add it, because I probably won't be able to add you. And I don't want to disappoint you like that, even though I probably already am because I can't add you to begin with. But you just probably wanting to add me and then saying no, it's on the video, probably disappoint you even more, so that's why I put that. And I even put an annotation before Brawl, so, um, it's before Brawl at the very beginning of it. So, there's that. And I don't really know what else to say. I could put it in the description, but I bet there still probably would be people putting their friend code out there. Um, I'm gonna test it in a bit, Brawl, the Brawl disc, and see if it actually does work. Ah, oh, stupid. Stonewall. It's making us way start. Well, moves. My eyes itchy. I'll just go at a regular pace. Um, I will test it. If it doesn't work, then there goes Brawl, I guess. It just worked all of a sudden, and then when I make a friend code video, it doesn't work. I hate that so much. I was actually looking forward to Brawl in some of y'all, to be honest, because I know Brawl's a very popular game. 
So why couldn't I not? Why, how could I not put that on there? You know. But now I don't have a brawl disc, probably. So, so much for that. It happens, though. I guess. I still play Mario Kart Wii out the freaking buttload. I guess you could say. I don't even know. Um, if you have me added on that, you could probably join from there. And any other games, probably I'll have to put something like, whenever you want to play me in this said game, let me know. Because I don't really play it unless someone asks me to. I'll probably have to say something like that. Because the only Wi-Fi game I currently play, in general, is Mario Kart Wii. Oh, and GoldenEye sometimes. Of course I get my GoldenEye in. And we have to help Wrinkly Kong in this one. And yeah, she's that old granny lady that helps you in Donkey Kong 64 and all that fun stuff. I think you have to help her get first. Try not to punch her. Aw, oh, dang it. She punches me! Okay, granny. Don't pull out your pepper spray on me. Jesus. Okay, let's attack Bucket Boy up there and see if we can do any damage. I still cannot believe Wrinkly attacked me. I'm not a Kremlin, that punch critter. You're still back for more? Bring it on. We'll make this Super Smash Brothers brawl right now, even though you weren't playable. Let's see, hold on, I have to check the challenge. Help Wrinkly, Wrinkly Kong finish in first place. I'm not going to be able to help that granny if she's going at two miles per freaking hour, and Bucket Boy up here is putting steroids in his freaking barrels cooking something up in the pot of his barrel thing. And now we're freaking going too fast, and I did not want a wild move. It's the last thing I wanted to do. Okay, Wrinkly, come on. Get your granny butt up here so we can get some stuff done. Where's Bucket Boy at to begin with? I want to freaking punch him so hard in the face. There you are. Eat fist. Are you kidding me? Where'd you come from? No, let's not hit Wrinkly. Even though we kind of deserve to get her back. Oh, he's on on guard. No wonder he's going so fast. Awesome. We hit him. And Granny's still going slow. Pick up the pace. Come on. Come on, Wrinkly. I can't hold him back forever. Hopefully you don't run into those. Oh my god. Let Wrinkly Kong win. Sure, if she'll actually pick up the freaking pace. Whatever the crap she's wearing is probably keeping her down. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. All I know is that that granny needs to get her pepper spray out right now and burn some eyes out. Come on. Get lethal, granny. I'm not going to be able to help you get first if you don't get your ass up here even though I'm in fourth. Let's see. Flaming bananas take rid of... get rid of Critter, that's good. And... she's going slow again. I didn't want the fish. Why did I get the fish? Jab you in the eye. Out of rage. Is there a stop button on this game? I'll just hit something. Oh, she's actually... Come on. Come on, pass me so I can let go of Mini Neki and wreak some havoc on that fat bucket man. Come on. Pass me. Come on. Yes, you're awesome. Now if you can actually stay in first and not get hit. Or throw your barrels at me. Jeez. Oh my god. Are you one of those grandmas that don't trust anyone and whip your purse out to hit them? I think that's how Wrinkly Kong is. If she, she can get on guard, that would be awesome, but she doesn't. And we get him instead. I thought if you just break... I give up. Oh well, she's wild moving, so that's good, and the monkey is jacking our bananas. It's not, that's not good. Yeah, she's got this in the bag. Jump in the barrel. There you go. 
Heck yeah, Grandma. Take first place by storm. Okay. How long are we in this? Because I might have to have this. Ah, oh, what the heck. I have everything else clumped up together in a huge old cluster F. I'll keep this video like that, too. Grab 1,000 bananas. Okay. I'll try that game. At least we're not saving a grandma on this one. Okay. I don't know the quickest route to gather all these bananas, so I'm just gonna take them as I see them. Probably not gonna go for ones in the air, though. Because that would probably be a waste. Because I probably would miss terribly. Okay, the trip barrel is probably gonna be our best friend in this, so... Even though we completely failed. I can't pull off any more tricks anymore. It's weird. I'm taking this path because there's a lot of bananas there. Okay. We haven't even scratched the limit. Oh, what the heck. We'll jump, I guess. Even though I just said I wouldn't. I'm still gonna do it. I wish I had a banana fairy right now, actually. Oh, stupid Zinger. I think that's his name. Are those things in Donkey Kong Country Returns? I haven't played the game to its fullest. But I don't know if those are in it or not. I know they're in other Donkey Kong Country games, but... Are they in the Returns one? I'm not sure, to be honest. Hopefully someone can enlighten me. Possibly, if they have played the game all the way. You know, I bought Epic Mickey and Donkey Kong Country Returns for Christmas, and I haven't, e I haven't beaten either game. I haven't even played either one that much, because, well, I don't know why, to be honest. And we're running out of time. This is amazing. We're gonna fail this mission, too, and take forever on it. And we totally missed the 50 banana. Yeah, we're definitely gonna fail. Gather some nanners. Come on, donkey. You got this. Dang it. Oh well. I also bought a bunch of other games before Christmas. I bought Goldeneye before Christmas. Oh, great. Hold on a second. I gotta sync my Wii Remote again because I pressed the button on the back. I hate when that happens. Okay try this again. I'll probably keep all the failures in here. I usually do that in my videos, not to, you know, be a bitch and not be lazy and cut it out, but just to show you all that sometimes it may be difficult and that I'm not really perfect, so I get to show you all my imperfections. And I know how if you see like a completely 100% awesome no failure video, then you're probably going to be like, wow, this is really boring. So that's why I keep the failures in might entertain you all a little bit more than what my voice can barely entertain you with, so that's why I keep the videos in. I probably need to get in that stunt barrel, because that's probably what's going to save me, but I'm not getting in it for some reason. Let's see, where was I? Oh yeah, I bought a bunch of games before Christmas and at Christmas, and I haven't even beat any of them. Let's see, I bought F-Zero GX. Which is my first F-Zero game, actually, and I really like the game. It's awesome. Recently, though, the audio cut off on it when I was playing the last time I played it, so I'm probably not going to play that for a while because I'm afraid to play it. Because I think it's going to fail again. Awesome. Awesome. Sucky. Yes. 30 is okay. We're actually making good time, I believe. Probably not. We missed the 50 banana again. Awesome. Let's see what other games did I buy. I bought Metroid Prime 2. I'm after all the Metroid games now. After I saw Nintendo Capri Sun's Metroid Prime walkthrough, playthrough, whatever you want to call it, let's play. A bunch of people call it a bunch of other stuff. I don't know. Well, ever since I watched that one, it looked awesome. So I'm just like, I really need to get these games because they look awesome. And the only one that this um, local store had. It's like a discount store where people take used games. That's where I caught all of mine from. 
and they take and they get new games too. Like the new releases, they get those, but they're not used. They're brand new, so that's my favorite gaming store to be honest, because they actually aren't douchebags like the other stores. Like GameStop, I absolutely hate that one. It screwed me over so many freaking times. Yes, we clear it. It's not even funny. And then let's see what other games did I buy. I bought The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker because one of my friends told me to get it and I'm just like, awesome, because I played Ocarina of Time, but I haven't played Wind Waker, so I wanted to play Wind Waker. And then I saw it at that local store and I'm like, I gotta have this. And then another game that I saw that I've wanted for a really long time was Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. What was the objective for this BS? I don't even know. Without hitting any obstacles, okay that does not include barrels, so. I wonder if that includes iron barrels, because we're probably going to fail a pretty decent sum if it is, and hopefully it's not TNT barrels either, because I'll fail if I hit those. But, um, move copter. Jeez. Let's see, um, I wanted that, um, Twilight Princess game for a really long time. It's been on my list for... <laughs> Uh, oh, we can hit Iron Barrel? No, we can't. Oh my god. Well, we hit it, and then we win a little bit, and then it's like, no. This game's such a bitch sometimes. <laughs> it's official. But, oh well, I still like this game a lot. It's fun to race with, with family and friends. If this game had Wi-Fi, though, I'd freaking go ballistic on it and probably play it much more than I already do, don't push me into those iron barrels or I will cut you. Stupid bucket boy. Um, let's see, where was I getting to? Oh yeah, Twilight Princess. Um, I'm actually gonna do Zelda, hopefully with as many Zelda Let's Plays as I can in the future. I can't really guarantee anything though, because I, <laughs> I cannot 100% those games to save my life. And I want 100% 100 one before I start on it. Because I don't want to fail epically and then just be like, well, this is a horrible let's play that I attempted to do. TNT barrels of death. So I want to be ready before I... Will this fail me if I... If, after I shake all the bees off, it'll be like, you failed. Because this game's being... Do you attack with your butt? Hopefully I don't fail after a good... Oh god, tornadoes. I wonder if Clutch hits with his butt. I cannot believe I didn't notice that until now. He just randomly maneuvers his butt in front of the barrel and then it explodes. Awesome. We got the golden banana of truth. Okay. I don't want to crash into any iron barrels, but there's so freaking many. I'm going to fail. I can already tell. I'm just going to jump a lot, I swear. Let's see. Wild move through here. We have a single lap left, so hopefully I don't fail, to be honest. I don't really... Ah, stupid squawks. What? If squawks hits us, we fail? Are you kidding me? God. What time are we at? 18 minutes? Um... I'll tell you what, I guess I will have to cut this in half because this will be one huge fail video. And I don't really want to have that happening if it's going to be multiple failures. Um, so I'll just cut it here so there's a decent sum of failures, but there's not one that overkills the video, I guess. There is a such thing as overkill with failures. So I will see you all next time. Thanks to you all for watching, and I'll see you, like I said, next time.